Yeah, hey guys. Um, so yes, uh, welcome, welcome. Um, thank you uh, for checking my video out. Um, it will be the first of many, but again, we're going to cover over um, Marvel Strike Force, which is uh, a fairly new game. Um, it's uh, a little bit over a year now, and I've been playing since pretty much the launch. So uh, great game, um, especially right now with Captain Marvel and the new uh, Creed Commandos uh, update. So it's a great time to jump into the game right now. And again, um, yeah, we're going to just go through some basic tips and tricks. Uh, some may be uh, similar to other YouTube videos, but again, I hope this will help you guys out. Um, first tip right here is just checking your objectives, right? Just making sure um, you're checking on these daily. And again, um, as uh, simple and as obvious as this sounds, I mean, um, people that don't realize uh, missing your objectives, like, it all adds up. So again, um, we're going to hit up the challenges, and again, we're just going to auto win, because again, I haven't been able to do the take 10 ones. Um, same with uh, jump back to my objectives. I'm not going to do the other uh, uh, challenges yet because again I can try those ones later on. But again um, next on the list um, buying your supplies and uh, this is like this is an important one where people kind of get a little um, impatient about and uh, I was there at one point as well when I first started playing when you need specific supplies you get a little greedy and you start buying them but here's the thing um, at the end of the day you're going to realize um, gold is a, such a crucial resource in this game and you need to maximize what you're using it for. So again, um, when you need to buy three supplies for your objectives, I wouldn't even, I wouldn't even dare spending 200k or, or um, uh, 16k or even 32k because again, that gold is just so valuable in this game. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna go and buy the um, cheapest there, uh, the 2500. So I'm gonna get three of those um, to complete the objective needed because again, um, when you're looking at these 16k, 32k, it's just way too much. So. Um, when you're uh, doing raids, that's going to provide way more than uh, enough of the materials, so there's no point in wasting gold, especially with how limited you are in this game. So again, now we're going um, to quickly, uh, oh, let's see here, uh, arena battle, then there's some, um, uh, okay, let's do an arena battle. Yeah, I, I, I've, uh, I left one here so I can just quickly show you guys again, just finishing that objective, right? So, um, I'm going to jump right into it, and again, um, my rank isn't too high right now, it's 243. Um, I'm just keeping it comfortable there. I found that once I get above uh, 50, it's just way too competitive and you gotta keep checking it. Um, with 243, I could stay in that bracket all day long without having to fight at all, so. All right, so I'm um, gonna quickly uh, this team here. And um, pretty typical play. Uh, Guardians of the Galaxy. Um, or, or, sorry, not Guardians of the Galaxy. Uh, Make sure it looks like, but yeah, we'll, we'll take it. Uh, done. And uh, I love it. He does it. He's off the ship. He's done, and he can block her gear. And then off the ship, it bleeds. Again. And again, you don't have to use the team. I think I just randomly pick the team this game. Just for the specifics of this video, keeping things straightforward, so that you don't get any specific that we use to play, to play. Um, we'll get, we'll touch that into later. Videos. Um, again, uh, pretty straightforward. Um, it's not going to be too hard. But again, the team that I chose for the arena. I, I know when you play the game enough, you know uh, what teams are good in the arena and what teams are absolutely terrible. Uh, this specific team, wasn't, uh, there wasn't too much synergy, so again, you have a very good advantage. Um, yeah. Stop. Okay, it's there. And bingo, bango. Okay. So again, like I was saying, I keep my rank kind of under 250 because again, um, it's just way too competitive. Once you get above 100, down to the 50 range, ah, I'm checking on the game every hour every 30 minutes just to make sure I'm in that bracket. So no, 250 is comfortable, and it doesn't give you that much more power, of course. So that's where I'm comfortable right now. Um, and uh, next, we're gonna just quickly jump into uh, blitz mode here. And again, um, I'm gonna buy all these, because again, I've got, the, uh, I've got enough materials for it. So um, and I've pretty much maxed all these players out. Again, that's with time. Um, with blitz right now, um, you can prioritize on certain characters that you don't have, but again, for me, I don't care. I've got, I've got lots to blow. And 
right now, we're just going through the objectives again and again. We're uh, quickly looking here. Let's see. Uh, let's, yeah, heroes campaign. That's easy. So again, um, pick the heroes that you don't have. Uh, I've pretty much got them all, but again, I like to select some of the ones from the first uh, chapter because again, it's cheap. Um, and I don't actually have a uh, Punisher fully maxed out yet, so that works out for me. Um, again, um, and now, now I'm going through here and I'm seeing that, uh, uh, let's see here, room campaign, all clear. Okay, so again, I don't need to, I can't donate because I donated last night, but again, um, that's, that's not that important. Again, I'm just going to accept all these because I want to get some extra um, energy so I can refill. And again, the only time you should be using your power cores is getting uh, 50 energy. And for me, I've been so self-sustainable, I haven't even been using it for the 50. I only use it, I only use the 50 uh, to recharge only when I have enough uh, uh, the backup tokens. So you don't need to use your power cores, and that way you can save it. And that's why I've got 6,000. Um, I'm keeping a large supply of that because again, with the upcoming uh, Marvel events coming up, I'm stockpiling my gold and my uh, power cores just to make sure whatever content comes out, I can, uh, I, I'm, I'm readily prepared for it. So again, um, uh, pretty straightforward. Um, now we're going to do the villains. Uh, and again, um, I don't have much of the defenders yet, so I'm going to go with, uh, with uh, Miss Jones here. Okay, now uh, villains good. I'm not going to hit accept yet, because again, uh, I've got maxed out on the, uh, on the Blitz. Uh, tokens, so I don't need to use that. I'll just save it. And again, um, just, just a preview of my characters. Uh, I'll show you guys a preview. Um, it's nothing impressive, but again, I've built this roster up since, uh, since the game's launched. So again, it's uh, it's it's not bad. It's not bad. It gets the job done for sure. It gets the job done, and uh, and um, again, um, you're probably wondering, whoa, whoa, as what's going on? How come you have so many? Uh, how come you have so many low-level players right there? So. Again, I'm gonna max out uh, Mystique here. Oh, uh, low battery. Um, I'm gonna get Mystique here because again, she's relatively new, and again, I'm just trying to utilize the rest of the energy. And again, um, jump back into the objectives here. And uh, the other tip too is um, checking on your objectives, making sure you're always coming back and checking on the game. Uh, that campaign energy is crucial. You're getting um, three of those a day, three times 80. That's 240 energy, right? That's that's way too good to pass up. Um, it's it's uh, you know that's that's almost two and a half character slots right there. I, I believe with a total, um, you get uh, your energy refreshed five minutes per. So I mean, again, um, that totals up to something like almost 600 energy a day. So I mean, it does add up. So half of it is coming from those extra bonuses. Um, now I'm quickly just gonna jump. Here. And I'll just show you guys. Um, these are the rewards for Blitz, and oh, I, I didn't clearly make it all the way for this one. Um, I was actually busy this weekend, so I wasn't able to finish her off quickly. But again, um, I've just started uh, on the new one. But the other two modes, um, uh, yeah, they're easy rewards. Like, look at the uh, look at the orb assault. It's easy rewards. Um, it's ridiculous. All right, um, I'll post future videos so how you, how you can quickly rack up those points for it um, but again you want to make sure you're getting all these rewards um, the game's giving you three ways to earn orbs and you want to maximize those opportunities i um, not to mention the gold not to mention the extra um, blitz uh, tokens so you can use so in case you want to you know unlock uh, um, any of the keys um, any of the uh, um, you know the cage um, you know any of the guys they got going on and they always add to that list when there's more characters unlocked so again you want to utilize that and most importantly um, uh, the most important resource um, that we fill for the raids uh, that comes in very handy because again it's a very res res rare resource and you're not going to be able to get that with um, you know uh, easily so it's good to max up on it I always do the blitz for that so that way you can stay fresh for the raids um, that's not to say you can't uh, do raids without them for sure you absolutely can um, but again I like to have that extra cushion and especially if you want to stay competitive right now um, yeah, you want to make sure uh, you're utilizing as much as you can. Um, so now I'm going to jump into the, uh, the milestones. They refresh every uh, three to four days, depending on uh, which one you get. And again, I haven't unlocked anything yet because I usually wait for this one. I usually wait until I have enough gold. And I know in this case, it usually costs about roughly six, seven mil. So again, I've got 11 there. 
and uh, I'm just going to quickly uh, level up some of the characters. So now that answers the question I asked you guys earlier, like why does this real have such low level characters? So again, um, I keep them low because A, um, you'll see in a future video, it actually helps with blitz mode, and B, um, it's for this exact reason that I can level them up and then I can utilize uh, the rewards for that, because again, those are free rewards for uh, the game, and you want to maximize as much as you can, especially if you're a free-to-play player. Um, starting from day one, I haven't spent a single dime on the game, so again, um, I'm gonna I'm gonna stay put and keep it that way um, for as long as I can. Um, again, I'm not a big spender, and I don't like to put money into video games, but again, um, I just want to maximize um, the efficiency that you can play at this game while you're a free-to-play player and you're not a whale dropping hundreds or thousands of dollars into the game because again um, a game should be a game right? it shouldn't be you know uh, it shouldn't be uh, world you know putting your life savings into so again that's that's just my opinion um, to each their own so um, now we're just gonna quickly look at some more characters uh, Wolverine again there's some future campaigns with Magneto so I'm gonna level them up again I'm gonna bring them up to 70 um, and you'll see right there uh, easy peasy um, gold's not a problem for me because again you want to stockpile that amount. You want to make sure you have enough of it, and uh, that way it makes things very, very easy. Because again, gold is a very hard to earn resource. So you want to make sure um, you can maximize your chance for that. Um, and again, uh, yeah, we're gonna level up Juggernaut here because again, we're gonna need him for Magneto. So level him up, and again, it helps us out with those milestones. Um, let's see here, uh, Mystique again. Yeah, let's bring her up. Perfect. And now we're just gonna jump into the milestone. And yeah, we're uh, almost there. Black, so black. You see, free power cores, free premium orbs. Again, same thing, right? Everything's free. You don't need to be spending loads of cash on the game if you're playing smart. And I know it's gonna be very tempting to spend that gold when you have that much of it. But again, you wanna be vigilant. Um, yeah, I'm gonna level up her because I need to work on her, especially for my Nick Fury team. So she's great as well. Um, and let's see, we have to do a couple more. I'm gonna do Hulk because again, um, he's not the greatest, but I want to get my collection up down to uh, bring them up to, to snuff, especially if they're Avengers. He might be receiving a buff, so you never know. Again, uh, there we go. Um, so three power cores. And now we're just going to quickly jump into my supplies. And there you go. Those are all the free characters. And then that will just go to your ultimate orbs. And again, uh, with that, you can, um, yeah, you can just roll the slot for that. And again, ultimate orbs are also a good way of income. Again, I'm not going to open any of these because, again, I'm waiting for more content, uh, more characters to add it. I usually stockpile premium orbs. So that way, when they have a new character released, um, I've got 50, 60 orbs waiting there. And it's easy. It's easy as pie. Let's see here now. Um, so no, um, the last point I'll make here is um, the alliances. So again, when you go into alliances, um, you want to make sure uh, you know you're in a good alliance. You want to get in early as you can. You want to level up to the point where you can get into one, and you want to situate a good one. Right now, I'm looking at one where we're, we always fairly, uh, we always get 100% on these, so this is easy. And the ones we're kind of struggling with right now are the alpha ones. Um, again, it's tough, but it's still worth it. Um, get in those alliances. You'll add more orbs. You'll add more gold. Um, it's just too good to pass up. And again, go to the rewards. Um, this is what I mean. You can buy the materials, so there's no point in you spending gold um, on these items. It's just a waste of time. It's just a waste of money. Um, you, it's better you utilize elsewhere, like leveling. So again, if you can utilize that and maximize um, your gold in those areas, you can get those milestones like the like the uh, like the one we just did. So, oh, and I'm yeah, quickly open up. I need to tell you guys. Um, I hope you guys like the video. I hope this helped. So again, objectives, your blitz, and then again your alliances. All right, those are the big three. 